Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Ruby Bridges was born in Arkansas, just a few months after the decision of Brown versus the Board of Education, declaring segregation in schools unconstitutional. In early 1960, Bridges was one of four black children who decided to attend a white school. Ruby alone attended Franz William Elementary School, where she faced racism, threats, and protest. She was escorted to and from school by federal marshals. Her decision to integrate into white schools paved the way for every minority student in the future. Daisy Bates was an American civil rights activist and journalist who covered the Little Rock integration crisis. She was the publisher of the Arkansas State Press and helped the Little Rock Nine become the first group of black students to attend Central High School in Little Rock. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. The Tuskegee Airmen were a pursuit squadron founded in 1941 at the height of World War II. However, this faction of airmen was notable in the regard as the first in American history to be created entirely of men of African descent. The men flew a total of 1,378 combat missions, with 1,067 of those being for the 12th Air Force, 311 for the 15th Air Force, and 179 bombing escort missions. The squadron is particularly renowned for a minimal loss of planes and lives, uncharacteristic of the military tactics of the period. Above all, the Tuskegee Airmen represent a step towards integration in aviation. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Muhammad Ali, nicknamed the greatest, was born in 1942 as Cassius Marcellus Clay Jr. in Louisville, Kentucky. At age 12, he took up the sport of boxing, and by 18, he claimed his first gold medal in the lightweight division of the 1960 Summer Olympics. Following his success in pro boxing, he became heavily involved in the growing civil rights movement. Joining the Nation of Islam, he refused to be drafted in the Vietnam War by his religious and ethical beliefs, causing him to be prosecuted and found guilty of draft evasion and stripped of his boxing titles. In spite of this, he continued to float like a butterfly and sting like a bee. He later became the WBA heavyweight champion four separate times, last holding the title in 1979. Muhammad Ali will continue to be remembered for his activism and show of prowess as a boxer. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Shirley Jackson was born November 30, 1924 in Brooklyn, New York. An elementary school teacher by trade, she developed an interest in her local chapter of the NAACP and Democratic Party Club. In 1964, she was elected the second African-American in New York State Legislature. And in 1972, she became the first African-American woman to seek a Democratic Party nomination. However, she was not permitted to participate in the televised debates. However, following legal action, she was able to give one speech, which garnered 152 delegate votes. Shirley Chisholm's contribution to civil rights and steps in diversifying primaries will lead a sizable mark on history. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Bessie Coleman was born in 1892 in Atlanta, Georgia to Susan and George Coleman. In her formative years, she worked as a sharecropper while attending a segregated school before attending Langston University, where she developed her interest in aviation. Bessie Coleman's most notable accomplishment was being the first woman of African and Native American descent to hold a pilot's license, which she received from Fédération Aéronautique Internationale in France in 1921 at the age of 29. She returned to the United States and became a prominent act in air shows across the country and garnered the nickname of Queen Bess. Despite her tragic death in an airplane accident, she will always be remembered as a step toward diversity in aviation. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Guillaume Bluford was born in 1942 around Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. He began his career in the sky at William Air Force Base, which he received as pilot wings before becoming an instructor just a year later. However, his career really took off when he was selected as a NASA astronaut, Group 8 to which he spent over 28 days in space. 
breaking new ground as the first African-American man and the second man of African descent in space. Guillaume Bluford will be marked as a trailblazer who soared to new heights. Timber Creek History Club proudly recognizes Black History Month. Ida B. Wells was an American investigative journalist and early leader in the civil rights movement. She was born into slavery and freed post-Civil War. After Wells had a friend murdered by lynching, she used her platform to highlight the racism, prejudice, and violence that Black Southerners faced on the daily. She was best known for her real-time reporting on the topic and her ability to keep reporting despite numerous threats. Ida B. Wells also actively fought against sexism and spent her entire life working for change. She became one of the founders of the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People. Through her work, Wells became one of the most famous black women in history.